Hey guys, this is Lister here, and this is going to be a tutorial on how to make a bucket server with Voxel Sniper in it as a plugin, and also you're going to be using a Matsy. So first, you want to go onto the bucket website, download the recommended build. Next, go onto the Voxel Sniper website or wiki and download the Voxel Sniper version 5.133, and finally go to this link and download this run under slice 2 batch file all these links will be in the description at the moment we're on 1.2.5 minecraft yep so once you've downloaded these three files you want to go onto your desktop and make a new folder just call it bucket and then you want to drag these three files into your bucket folder once you're in here you're going to want to double click this run batch file and it'll open up a command window and it'll make all the bucket server files and start preparing the spawn area so while that's happening I'll t if this video is pretty old and there's a new bucket out so you're not on craft bucket dash 1.2.5 dash r 1.0 to make this run batch file work with this the new one you want to right click it hit rename and copy that name of the new one Go into the run and right click it hit edit and here you'll see it says craft bucket the craft bucket we're using at the moment you want to highlight this keeping the dot jar and paste in the name of the new craft bucket and just save it and now that run files run batch file should run your new craft bucket so now here you can see that the spawn area is all done and it's finished you just want to type stop and it will close down the server. Next you want to download Hamachi and install it. It's pretty simple. You just go on to Google type in Hamachi but I'll put a link in the description. Um, you go to network, create new network, name it, put a password in and then your friends can join that network and it means only people in your Hamachi can join your game. Plus it means that your IP address will always be this exact IP address. It'll never change. So you want to open up your server file or sorry your server properties text file and you want to right click this IP and hit copy IPv4 address you can now minimize Hamachi and go to server IP paste it in here and basically that's it uh, you can change like your message of the day um, the amount of players, what game mode you're in, the difficulty, PvP if it's online, if you want your friends to be able to play say they don't actually own minecraft they've downloaded it illegally or whatever uh, you can just make this false and it makes it a crack server and it won't uh, link up the minecraft's website to make sure they have an account and basically that's it you can make it allow nether and things so you just want to save that close it and now you can find this voxel sniper dot jar file just drag it, oh no, just drag that folder, ah, just drag that file into your plugins folder in bucket and once that's done you just hit run and as you can see in the command Voxel Sniper has been loaded so we now just want to type stop and as you can see here there's an ops text file open it and type your minecraft name and date and save it close it down and go into plugins now in here once you've run voxel sniper you just it'll make a new folder called voxel sniper you go into there and go to wait oh no sorry not even you just go to this snipers folder on the old one it was in that their folder but the snipers text file open it up and type your minecraft name in again and save it so basically this here allows anyone's name in there to be able to use voxel sniper so people can't just come in and wreck your world and this ops file is sort of like an administrator so you can use every command so once all that's set up you just want to run your server again and now this is all loaded up you go into your minecraft and hit login it would work 
Okay, so once we're in Minecraft, you go to multiplayer, and you're gonna hit add server. And server name, you can have whatever whatever you want. But from your Hamachi, you want to copy this same address, and all your friends will do the exact same. They will copy your address. So say Simon was hosting the server, I'd right click, hit copy address, paste it in. But you want to copy your own address because you're hosting the server. Paste it in using Control V, and then do a colon and type two five five six five. Is that a space or is that just? So basically, that number there is the port in your server f here. So if you want to change that, your server port, just do a colon and then the port number. And as you can see, it's online. So now we can just hit join server, and we're now in a new Minecraft world. At the start, it'll be a bit laggy until all the chunks are loaded and stuff, but as you can see if I have forward slash V voxel set the snow so I can go into mode one maybe I can't I don't know bucket commands but here you need to give yourself an arrow give forward slash give give me um arrow two. So now we have an arrow. Just type forward slash um B five space five. That makes your brush size five. And as you can see forward slash V Fox will set the snow or with V four. Set the cobblestone and there you go it now puts cobblestone in the ground where far away or whatever you want and then B size 5 move Fox will set the error but yeah I can't really remember the commands for Voxel, but that's Voxel installed on your server and your server is running fine. So guys, hope you enjoyed this video and hope you got Voxel Sniper installed and working. Uh, please subscribe, like and comment and I will bite back with another video on how to make a Terraria floating island with Voxel Sniper.